everyone, thank you for clicking on this video. I'm Riva Elika. I'm a college student of Polytechnic Negeri Banjarmasin on Informatics Engineering Study Program. I like to share with you information how to make a traffic light simulation using Tinkercad. Tinkercad is a free online 3D modeling program that runs in a web browser. You can create anything. Tinkercad was founded as a company in 2010 in the European Union. Known for its simplicity and ease of use, in 2011, it has become a popular platform. Let's get started! First at all, make sure your internet connection was connected. Next, open Google Chrome and search Tinkercad. Then, click Sign In. I choose by email or username. If you're a new user, you must create an account by clicking this one. Next, enter your email and password. We choose circuits and create new circuit. This is components. You can choose and search all the components you need to make a circuit. To make a traffic light simulation, I need 5 resistors, 5 flats, a breadboard, an Arduino, and a lot of wire. Put the LED anywhere. On the LED, there's a cathode and anode. Make sure the resistor was connected to the cathode. Next, connect the wire from a node to the desired pin. And then, connect the wire from resistor to the ground. The ground is always marked in black, so change the wire's color. Change the LED and wire colors to make difference and to make the circuit look much more neat. Because we use a lot of modules, so we need a breadboard. This part was connected horizontally and this one vertically. So you can put the LEDs and resistors anywhere. Resistor is used to limit the flow of electricity so that the LED doesn't overload and can last a long time. Pins 0 through 13 as digital I.O. pins. This is a USB jack. It used as a data communication link between Arduino and computer. A positive circuit will end on a negative ground. After the circuit was finished, we move to the code section. Choose text and type the program's code. This is to declare a pin embedded in the Arduino circuit. Void setup is the default Arduino program. Pin mode function to call components and receive I.O. signals. Void loop is the default Arduino program. Digital write function to give high or low values to the digital pin. This sign is required. This is time delay. 100 is 1 second in real time. Last, we click Start Simulation so that the Arduino can be run. When the red light is on, pedestrians are given the opportunity to cross. When the yellow light or green light is on, pedestrians must stop and wait their turn. All changes have been saved. We're back to Tinkercad menu and change our project's name. That's all the steps to make a traffic light simulation using Tinkercad. Hopefully, you get new knowledge from this video. For those of you who want to try making it, keep on fire and don't give up. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like and share to your friends. Bye-bye.